Fox News host Jesse Waters was ridiculed for saying if his wife were to secretly vote for Democratic nominee Kamala Harris, he would see it as the same thing as having an affair. On a recent installment of The Five, the panel had been discussing wives of conservatives voting against former President Donald Trump after new polls came out showing the Republican nominee doing abysmal numbers with women. Waters derailed the panel's discussion when he said, if I found out Emma was going to the voting booth and pulling the lever for Harris, that's the same thing as having an affair. That violates the sanctity of our marriage, the Fox host continued. What else is she keeping from me? What is she lying about? Fellow panelist Judge Janine Pirro pushed back at Waters, asking him, why would she lie to you? Instead of answering her question, Waters doubled down, saying, why would she do that and vote Harris? Why would she say she was voting? If I caught her and she said, I lied to you for the last four years. Piro followed Waters' comment, asking, so you'd admit you'd intimidate? It's over, Emma. Waters declared, yelling into the camera. That would be D-Day. Several Fox News critics took to social media to mock Waters for threatening his wife with divorce on air. One user on X formerly known as Twitter, wrote, I've never seen a man so fragile. It absolutely eats at this man that he can't treat his significant other like a slave. Another person commented, this is what every Trump supporter wants. They brag about controlling their wives and actively say they want to abolish the 19th Amendment so their god emperor can be declared king. This comes after the Harris campaign released a new ad suggesting women keep their vote secret so they can choose Harris without their Republican voting husbands knowing about it. In the ad voiced by pretty woman actress Julia Roberts, a woman wearing an American flag hat looks sheepishly back at her husband as she heads to a voting booth. She is seen marking the Harris Waltz option and smiling at another woman voting. Then her husband asks her if she made the right choice, and she responds, sure did, honey. In the one place in America where women still have a right to choose, you can vote any way you want, and no one will ever know, Robert said in a voiceover. Remember, what happens in the booth stays in the booth. A new National University of Massachusetts Amherst poll has found that Vice President Harris holds a two-point lead nationally over former President Trump, 48 to 46. The poll, conducted October 11 to 16, and included an oversample of women, also found that women prefer Harris, 50 to 43.